your news leader. It was a full house at the Blasco Library as Senator Bob Casey took questions from an open audience. The Wounded Warriors Project helped more than a dozen veterans saddle up for a morning of riding. Community members as well as students from around the area team up with Serve Erie for some much needed help at Erie High School. We'll take you inside to show you their hard work. Live in high definition from your news leader, this is Jet 24 Action News at 6. Saturday. Volunteers with Serve Erie gathering again at Erie High School for some much needed repairs. Jet 24 is Krista Nielsen. Talked with some of those folks getting their hands dirty for a good cause. She joins us in the studio. Hello, Kristen. Thanks, Dave. Surveyry has made repairs to several of the city's schools. Today was the second day of renovations at Erie High School. Over a thousand volunteers turned out to lend a hand. About a thousand volunteers rolled up their sleeves and got to work for the second day of repairs at Erie High School. Kaylin Schneider, a student at Collegiate Academy, played volleyball for Central last year and says the work being done here is desperately needed. And my teammates would always complain about like the bathrooms and the walls and how run down the school is. But with the hard work of volunteers, this school will have a fresh look for the start of the school year. Serviri had this project planned well before the fire occurred in this building, but they were glad to see that with the added attention that thousands of people came out to volunteer. I mean, we really view it as kind of a God sovereignty thing that, you know, this was in place before any of that stuff happened. Now, any community that shows, that cares, anything can be successful. The students are going to be successful. Everyone's going to be su successful this year. So I think it's going to be really cool, especially with, like, all the new kids coming here to have it, like, remodeled, and it's nice to bring everyone together. And our dream is that in the fall, when the kids come back to school here, that they're going to experience the hope and the love and all that stuff that's been poured into these couple of days. Organizers tell us that it's great to see so many students getting involved in volunteering to help their school. They say investing their time into their own school will help maintain the hard work done by this group. Dave? All right, great project. Thanks a lot, Kristen. Well, Liberty.